You know what it is. You know who it is. It's the sizzle here on Iron Skillet Television, Iron Skillet Radio. We are in the building, baby, and we hot as ever. You know who's in the building, Rich Sizzle, Jay Sizzle, and you know what we get ready to do. Every time we come on, we hit you with the hot five and five. Iron Skillet Sports presents... Five and five, Jay Sizzle. Yo, you know what's in the building, NFL. But what's not in the building is the NFL game. Any games, but they, they canceled the All Star, the 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 enshrinement game. Though, what else have they canceled? Jay says, "Oh, look, they had to cancel everything because anybody who was going to be enshrined in the Hall of Fame couldn't have went anyway. Look, COVID nineteen needs to have its own bust." up in the Hall of Fame, because it's the only thing that's been able to stop all of these Hall of Famers. No bet, no football. It ain't happening. No Hall of Fame game. That's that'd be, that's a good thing, because the Dallas Cowboys are going to probably end up losing that anyway. Oh, that is hot. Ah! hot fire. Rich Sizzle. Uh, the NBA and the COVID have had a interesting experience. They say that it's going to be bubble games coming. You've even got people saying they're going to put on a show out there, baby. Are you ready for the NBA and the COVID? Let me tell you something, Greg. I, I, let me just be serious with you for one second, all right? Do you realize that sand from the Sahara Desert has made it to the Americas faster than America has a grass on this COVID thing? Um, At this point, the only two people that are going to be playing in the NBA is the Greek Freak and LeBron James. That's about it. Even Jabari Parker came down. You know, he can't catch – he cannot catch a break if he were from Midas right now. Now he has the COVID. I mean, yeah. come on. Nobody wants to play. The people that want to play are catching the COVID. What you going to do? Yeah, it's a real situation, and nobody really knows what to do. So, Jay Sissel, give us some, some light at the end of this tunnel. Is there any light for the NBA at Disney? Well, look. They said they're going to be playing two or three basketball games a day at all of the arenas all around the park. But the fun part about that is, <laughs> like there's going to be no fans, there's going to be no basketball players. Look, I don't know. It's going to be Minnie, Mickey. Who, who, was, who was the team that played on Space Jam? That's who has to come out and play right now because that's <laughs> the only basketball that's going to be big down at Disney. <laughs> The Monsters. <laughs> the Monsters. The Monsters will be there. We won't be there, but you know who else won't be there? The Bears. Well, maybe they will be. Ha ha, Clinton Dix found out that the Bears are always around. You can't get away from the Bears. Rich Sizzle, do you know about Ha ha and the Bears? Oh, yeah. Well, first of all, I want to address, I don't know what a grown man is doing on a scooter. Um... But uh, like you said, listen, this was a friendly reminder that once a bear, always a bear. What you running for? You know, if you ran the way you ran from that bear and his little cub the way you did last year, maybe you'd have a bigger contract. I don't know. Oh, that is, oh, that is ridiculous. Ha ha. Yeah, no, no. It was, but did, did he have a nice turn and pivot? When he threw the scooter, was it a nice turn and pivot? Did he actually get up and go, ha ha, and ran away? I don't know what he did, listen, but it was listen, bad. That scooter kept going for a good 10, 15 miles, felt like. The Bears just looked at it like, yeah. What's going on here? <laughs> oh, they, the they, Bears they kinda, were out. Yeah, they got scared. You know what I'm You see like a whole bunch of people start running, and then you start running. That's exactly what the Bears, they're like, uh-uh, oh, we're out of here. <laughs> <laughs> So the Bears are out of there. But one person who thinks he's back in there is A.B. Antonio Brown. There are reports now surfacing that Antonio Brown could be going to the Seattle Seahawks. Jay Sizzle, what do you think about A.B. at the Seahawks? Oh, he could be going to the Seahawks, but he's going to miss this plane. Look, A.B. is not ready to play football. We talked about this about a year or so ago that he looks like he's having CTE on um, problems because he should be in concussion protocol right now look if he could play that would be great with him and and, and uh and russ that would be fantastic but he would have been great with tom brady he would have been great and with the pittsburgh steelers i'm telling you right now ab is not going to play but the guy we should look for is the little resurgence of greg olsen down there if he can stay healthy mm, 
That's Hot 5 and 5. That is your Hot 5 and 5, the hottest topics, the five hottest topics going on right now in sports. 